dog. We are all bundled up. We so are cold. Oh my freezing. goodness. This is ridiculous. That's Stephanie's dad back there. He's hanging out with us today. And we, AKA Grand Bob. Grand Bob, that's what we call him. His name's Robert, Bob, Grand Bob. That's where that came from. So uh, Ace, where are we going today? Santa! Santa! We're gonna go see Santa. We're going to Bass Pro Shops in Fort Lauderdale, Hollywood. Is Hollywood or Fort Lauderdale? Hollywood, Fort Lauderdale. Hollywood, Fort Lauderdale. <laughs> so uh, we're gonna take the train there because the traffic this time is kind of crazy. So we're just gonna get on the train and cruise down. And we thought it'd be fun. So. And fun, yeah. We're gonna go on the choo-choo train. Yeah. Jack, say choo-choo. Choo-choo. <laughs> How handsome is this boy? Oh my yeah. goodness. Hey, look at... They look adorable right now, ready to meet Santa. And also, when I left for work today, the plan was to wear Mickey Mouse sweaters for our picture. <laughs> so I'm wearing a Mickey Mouse sweater. So I get home, we get in the car to leave. And I'm the only one. No Mickey Mouse sweaters. But we put these on this morning and who said, oh, that's so cute, maybe they should just wear that to Santa. I said, maybe they just should. Maybe you should have notified me. <laughs> you guys are all looking cute. I'm looking a little tacky. But hey, I guess I always do. All right, who's ready to see Santa? <laughs> at that. Me. Can you say Santa? Santa. Yay. Yeah, Manu. See, at least Jack likes my outfit. Woo. Here comes the train. Choo choo. All righty, we're on the train. We're going to see Santa. We are going to see Santa. What are you going to tell him you want for Christmas? I think that it was quiet A big fat airplane that flies in the air? What about you, Jack? What do you want for Christmas? Santa? Yeah, we're going to see Santa. What do you want for Christmas? Santa! Do you want cookies? Cuckoo. Cuckoos. <laughs> do you want chicken? Mama. Do you want Mickey? Manu, do you want Woody? Woody. We made it. Woohoo! Fishies! Whoa, fishies! Some big fishies. What do you see, Jack? Fishies! Whoa! Yeah! Those cool? Whoa, that's a big catfish. Whoa, here comes a big one. Whoa! Whoa! What'd you say? He's a great big fatty? <laughs> Santa! Are you ready, Ace? Yeah. Yeah. Who do you see, Jack? Santa! 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 I think this is the only one year old ever that's just so excited. I know. <laughs> Take me to Santa. Take me to Santa. Appreciate that. Santa! Oh. Wow. Santa's grumpy today. That's okay. I don't think he, I don't think he heard me. So. That was really sad. Jack was so excited to see Santa, and Santa was just not excited at all to see him. He just said, "All right, put him on my lap." <laughs> that was not the real Santa, guys. We have an imposter alert. That was really so sad. Ace spent so much time. Uh, preparing what he was gonna tell Santa what he wanted for Christmas. What were you gonna tell Santa you wanted for Christmas? A Mickey Mouse fishing pole. A Mickey Mouse fishing pole. And what else were you gonna ask for? A bike. A bike. Yeah, he's been telling me all day that he was gonna tell Santa that he wanted a bike and a Mickey Mouse fishing pole. 
And then Santa didn't even ask him what he wanted for Christmas. And an airplane. And an airplane. And then Santa didn't even ask him what he wanted for Christmas. And when Stephanie said, hey, can he tell you what he wants for Christmas? He just kind of, he started talking. Santa wasn't really listening. They just kind of handed him the candy cane and like shooed us away. That was really awful. Like typically when negative things happen, I don't put it in the vlog. I just kind of edit it out and move on. But that just really bummed me out because the boys were so excited to see Santa and Santa was just not excited to see them. And that's just not the job that you should have. When you think about everything that Santa represents for kids, like the magic of Santa and the affirmation of Santa as a child means so much. And when a kid comes up so excited to meet you and you're just could care less. Just really disappointing. I can understand having a hard day and that kind of stuff, but just not the job you should be doing if that's going to be your attitude. As a kid, you sing songs about Santa, you watch movies about Santa, and every kid it gets so excited to go and meet Santa. And then Santa's not excited at all to see you. Like that's going to make kids think like, "Oh no, like have I been naughty? Why wasn't Santa excited to see me?" And and not even that, but he just didn't even respond when they talked. It's not even that he wasn't excited, but he wouldn't even respond to them when they were talking to him. Luckily, we were able to meet the real Santa Claus at Disney World, and he was very excited to see us and had lots to talk to us about. And that Santa Claus was much more busy than this guy. Woo! Woo! So cold. All right, guys, we're back at the train station. So after we saw Santa, we went to go get food at the Bass Pro Shop restaurant. And I didn't vlog it because it was just a disaster. So we had to wait like an hour and a half to get in and to finally get our food. And now look at Jack. Hey, why does Jack look different? He's got a different shirt on. I had sweet tea and he dumped it all over us. And his shirt just got completely soaked. So we're going to bring him back outside in a soaking wet shirt. So Jack got a new shirt today. <laughs> all right. everybody man what a day hope you guys enjoyed that vlog I know I already gave a big long rant on Santa but I just had a couple more thoughts you know I was I was trying to like give the guy the benefit of the doubt and say oh maybe he's having a rough day but you know the more I thought about it is you know the, well there's the real Santa and sometimes you're lucky enough to re meet the real Santa but typically this time of the year he's at the North Pole getting ready for Christmas so he sends out his helpers and if you're one of Santa's helpers you're an actor. Your job is to play the role of Santa. So you don't get to have a bad day because when you show up for work, you're an actor. You're not you. You're Santa Claus and you represent Santa Claus. So your job is to represent that character. And so, man, I was just so bummed because the kids were so excited to see Santa and just to see that he just was ignoring them. Like Ace was so excited and just talking to him and had all this stuff to say. He'd been thinking all day about things he wanted to talk to Santa about. And it, it wasn't even that he was like rushing us. He was just ignoring him. He wasn't even, he wouldn't even look at Ace. He was just looking up. All right, take the picture. And the, the camera people weren't paying attention. So he whistled at him and just blatantly ignored the kids. Call out sick, do whatever you gotta do. If you can't play the role, don't show up. So anyway, I'll stop ranting about that. But anyway, so after that, I actually went and talked to the manager, which is something I typically never do. Because I, I watched and saw how kid after kid would come up, Santa, Santa, and he didn't even acknowledge him. And so I went to the manager, I said, hey, just so you know, Santa's in a bad mood back there, and he's not being very kind to the kids. And the manager said, oh yeah, we have two Santas and one's just awful. <laughs> I couldn't believe he said that. But anyway, I told him, I said, you know, my kids are probably too young to really understand. But for an older kid uh, that Santa just blatantly ignores you, that could be devastating. So anyway, so I'm going to stop ranting about that. You fake Santas better watch out. We're coming for you. <laughs> But anyways, I hope you guys are all having fun celebrating this Christmas season, the most wonderful time of the year. Hope you guys are spending time with your families, having fun, and all that good stuff. And I hope you guys have been having fun joining us here on the vlog. We're just a week till Christmas. How did that happen so fast? Ah!
So much to do, so much to get ready for. So we got lots of fun leading up to this last week of Christmas. So make sure you come back every day right here on the vlog. We love you guys. Thanks for joining us. Your support really means the world to us. Thanks for leaving comments. Thanks for sending your love. We are so appreciative of you guys. You guys are the best. But with that, we love you guys. And Merry Vlogmas.